What's up, you guys? It's Susan Morad right back here on Clever News. And Potterheads were in for quite a magical treat this weekend as the cast of Harry Potter reunited and shared some behind the scenes secrets. Almost two whole decades have passed since the premiere of Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, but the magic is just as alive as ever before. In honor of the 19th anniversary of the first film's debut, the cast of Harry Potter, including Daniel Radcliffe, Tom Felton, Bonnie Wright, Ivana Lynch, Rupert Grint, and many others took part in a virtual reunion as they reminisced on some of their fondest memories while filming together. After hinting about a special reunion last month, Tom Felton, who plays Draco Malfoy in the movie adaptation of the popular books, hosted the live event via the platform Veeps using the hashtag 19 years later, which instantly began trending on social media. Together, the cast laughed as they recalled many behind the scenes moments that went down while filming. Rupert Grint, who played Harry's best friend Ron Weasley, just welcomed a new baby girl with his girlfriend Georgia Groom, but was able to take a break from dad duties to pop in and share some never before heard memories. He began by admitting that he wasn't exactly the most professional when trying to film serious scenes, detailing his incessant laughing problem, and even admitting that at times it would get so uncontrollable that he and Daniel would have to actually film scenes separately. The first film, the scene where we're in the train carriage. We literally had to shoot that separately. So whenever you watch that, we're never in the same carriage because we couldn't look at each other in the eye. Rupert also revealed that his laughing problem would carry into some of the most inappropriate scenes, adding, Dumbledore's funeral was a particular bad one. For some reason, I found that absolutely hilarious. And yeah, once you start laughing, it's very hard to stop. I think a lot of us have been in that situation before, am I right? Personally, breaking out laughing at a time I really shouldn't be is one of my biggest fears. Anyway, he also went on and let fans in on a little nickname he was given as a result of all the laughing, saying, I had a particularly bad reputation. They used to call me Go Again Grint because I could never do anything without doing it like 20 times. In between the reminiscing, Tom also entertained viewers with a musical performance, as well as a few cameos from his four-legged co-star, Willow. He took some time to answer fan questions, like what his first memory on set was, to which he responded by saying that his main memory was simply, quote, a bunch of kids excited to be there, running around. Tom also revealed why the film's director, Chris Columbus, didn't let the kids see the Great Hall until it was time to film there. He wasn't relying on the uh, terrible acting skills of an 11-year-old. He actually brought us in on camera for the first time. So when you see us looking around going, Woo! no acting skill required at all. Although Emma Watson, who played Hermione Granger, wasn't able to make this year's live event, fans were thrilled to hear some good news delivered by Daniel Radcliffe, who teased an epic reunion for next year's 20th anniversary. Well, my first thoughts are that this this is but a, a mere preview of the nostalgia we will we'll all be uh, immersed in next year when it is 20 years since the, the first film was released. On that note, it's safe to assume that Potterheads from around the world were clearly having a blast during Saturday night's live stream, as many took the opportunity to thank Tom and the cast for putting a smile on the faces of millions after a year full of hardships and turmoil. One user wrote, I keep watching Tom Felton's home party. It was absolutely brilliant. Thank you so much, Tom, for making me have no worries and just smile for the evening. Lots of love. Another fan tweeted, Thank you, Tom Felton, for making us all feel the love and nostalgia tonight. The beautiful memories we made watching this amazing cast grow up and reminiscing together 19 years later. We're so proud of you, Tom, and we love you so much. Ah, <sighs> what a successful Harry Potter hangout this was. But it only makes us that much more excited about the big 2-0 come next year. And to see how Tom Felton recruited his father from the films for a recent TikTok challenge, click right over here for another clever video. Then be sure to let me know all of your thoughts on the Harry Potter reunion and also what were you most surprised to hear about in the comments section below. I'm your host, Susan Morad. You can find me on Instagram at Susan underscore Morad. I'll catch you later. Bye, guys.